I'm always looking for ways that I can just kind of kick up the flavor of my dishes. And I've come up with this mixture that is full of heat and it's full of great flavor. So for this mixture, you need to kind of like something spicy and hot. And once you have this mixture on hand, you can kick up any dish that you're cooking up in the kitchen. And I like to start with coconut. So coconut goes into either a food processor. This is my mini food processor. A blender doesn't work quite as well unless you have a high speed blender, you could probably try that. So I've got a cup of unsweetened shredded coconut and be sure to use the unsweetened because you don't want to add sweetness to your dishes. You just want to add some great flavor. Unsweetened shredded coconut is available in the natural food section of your grocery store. And then I've chopped up two really chubby cloves of garlic. I'm going to add that right in there with the coconut. And then for the heat, I've got some dried chili peppers that I'm going to pull the stem off and then just kind of squeeze it, break it apart as I drop it into my food processor. And if you want it a little hotter, you could add three or four Thai chili peppers. And if you want it a little milder, just use one. So once you have those three ingredients in your food processor, you just turn it on and let it go a little bit until that garlic and the red peppers are all blended up with that coconut. So when you have it blended up, you can see that you'll still see some little pieces of red pepper. There's no sign of any garlic that has really gotten just really chopped up really, really fine and it's mixed in with the coconut. Then I like to just keep this in a jar in the refrigerator. And when I'm making stir fry, I'll add a couple tablespoons. Or when I'm making some soup, especially squash soup, oh, it's so good when you stir a little bit into the soup. But if you love popcorn, which I do in the winter, we eat a lot of popcorn at night, then it might be getting a little bit boring already. So you can sprinkle this on your popcorn with a little salt and a little pepper and whatever you use. Maybe you put on some butter or some avocado oil or coconut oil and sprinkle this on. Oh my gosh, that will really kick up your popcorn. So have some of this in your fridge and just experiment with it. You will find all kinds of ways and all different dishes to really kick up. I'm Sue Doden sharing Good Food for Good Life 365.